Have you heard about fat analysis but still wondered how it can increase profits? In this film, we'll show you how accurate tests with the purpose-built Meatmaster can boost profits in a real-world scenario. There'll be no complaints from the customer about this delivery because, as always, the fat content is spot on. Meanwhile, the producer is more than happy with the situation because he has hit his lean point precisely, making the very best use of raw material and making maximum profit. Well, traditionally, the butcher would look at the meat and say, well, it's so-and-so, it's 20% fat, but that way has been abandoned all over the world now. Then you can take out a sample from your batch, take that to the lab and do chemical analysis or NIR analysis. That's a good way to do it, but to grab a sample from a batch of, say, 3,000 pounds and then to grab maybe 100 grams and say this is representative for the entire batch, that is extremely difficult. That's why it's very important to measure the entire batch. All the meat that goes into the batch should be measured. That's the only way you can ensure that your fat number is correct. And there are a few ways to do that. An X-ray has become the golden standard. We insert the Meat Master 2 directly after our initial grinding process. So we'll grind our raw materials and then pass them through the machine. Once the materials pass through the machine, we get very reliable readings on the fat content and the total weight. Users of the Meat Master have found it to be at least 0.2 to 0.3% more accurate than alternative inline analytical solutions. Using the Meat Master 2, we're able to target a fat percentage for our batches and we find that the Meat Master 2 is very accurate in determining the fat percentage of those batches. So therefore, since we're able to set a target and hit it consistently, it's improved our yield. Now 0.2 to 0.3% may not sound like much of a difference, but it can result in a huge boost in value for the company using it. Let's see how, using two different production plants as examples. Production manager A has set a fat specification of maximum 20% fat in his burger products. He's using an analytical method with an error of 0.8%. This margin of error gives him a certain variation over time, and it gives him a distribution curve like this one, where he has set the fat point to 18.4% to make sure that he does not go over the target of 20%. The set point is calculated by multiplying the 0.8% error with a recommended standard deviation interval of 2. 0.8% times 2 equals 1.6%. Subtracted from 20% gives a set point of 18.4%. Now let's see how another production manager, B, is doing things at another big production plant. He's got his analytical error down to 0.6%. This means that his fat content does not vary quite so much. This production manager can use more fat in his burgers, still with confidence that he will be on target. In fact, he's been doing this consistently for years, and now the head office is really starting to take notice. This is because the price difference between the fat and the leaner raw material has been around 1 euro per kilo. And since he is producing around 25 tons of burgers daily, this has been giving a saving of around 1,000 euros per day on raw material costs. The results that we get on the food scan compares very favorably to the Meat Master. They're very close. Matter of fact, we've done our own analysis in-house, and <clears throat> over the course of about, of about 500 samples, we found that the average difference between the food scan and the Meat Master was negligent, literally 0.00, .00 on average. Besides the obvious financial benefits, the Meat Master 2 helps to achieve greater consistency in quality that is appreciated throughout the value chain. Dual Energy X-ray, uh, which was introduced by FOSS back in 2003 uh, with our fir first Meat Master, um, has become the golden standard of, of the industry. Utilizing the Meat Master 2, we've been able to increase our efficiency, improve our lean point difference, which is our yield, and improve our product consistency. If you want something that really measures accurately for the purpose you're working with, you need a product that is, uh, has been 
designed specifically for that purpose. And the Meat Master, and especially the Meat Master 2, uh, is the latest in this development.